Hey guys, this is RJ again. I uh, just want to show you uh, how I have my Chevy HHR set up inside. <clears throat> and I'll probably, if I can get to an area where I can uh, take things out of my vehicle, it's kind of hard to take things out when, you know, I'm living in a parking lot. Um, I can take things out and show you a little bit more how I have things set up. Um, basically, this is how I set things up during the night, sometimes during the day if I want privacy. Um, in the front window, I have just uh, one of those window uh, sunscreens. I actually put that up at night um, and leave that up. I've closed the, um, <clears throat> the sun visors down. Um, I keep my shoes up here. I um, have other things here. This is, this is Larry the Lobster guy. You know, I want him at the fair, so he's kind of keep me company while I'm living on the road, I guess, or in my car. Um, in my windows, I have them actually blacked out. Um, on the back, I've got a fan in the back as well. Um, on the back windows, I have the same type of cardboard. It's just that I've got it with um, some sticky stuff on it to keep it on the windows. Um, and what I do at night is I actually take these, and as you can see, they come right out. Um, I actually take these and put these in the window, and it will block a good bit of the sun. It will block a good bit of light. Um, especially living in, in parking lots, you have a problem with cars coming by at night, um, things like that. You know, showing a lot of light and, you know, street lights and things. So I kind of try to keep it as dark as I can as possible. Um, <clears throat> I do have some things in the back. I actually have to move all this stuff in here. I have a mattress here. I don't know if you can see it. Um, it's, a, it's a mattress that I sleep on. Um, and it goes up all the way in the back and it's folded up and I can show you that later. Um, but I actually have to move all this stuff here. I've got two bins of food, um, canned goods and stuff cause I can't cook. So I actually have to, you know, I, I have to eat out of cans, you know, go to Walmart, buy a bunch of cans and, you know, just stock up on stuff. Everything I have to eat is cold. Um, it's out of cans. Um, I don't have a lot of money to throw around on fast food. Plus fast food is kind of bad for you and I'm trying to, you know, not kill myself in the process. Um, and that's another thing too. A lot of people think that all homeless people are on drugs, drink alcohol, smoke and stuff. I don't smoke, I don't do drugs, and I do not drink alcohol. Um, so I basically, you know, my drink is water. Now this, this is what I drink and that's it. Um, I got a suitcase, my suitcase is full of clothes that I keep. I do have some luxuries, like I have one, um, one chair that I use, you know, if I need to set it out, I've got a fishing pole and stuff like that. Um, all the stuff in the back, I have to move. I got my, my um, tackle box in there. I've got other things. Um, I got a backpack full of stuff. I have a sleeping bag that I bought from Walmart and this thing actually broke. Paid $50 for it, the zipper broke on it. And you know, now basically all I have is a $50 blanket <laughs> that I sleep with. This zipper completely and utterly just, just tore. It's, it's a piece of crap. So, um, but yeah, I, I block all my windows at night as much as I can. Um, the only the only downfall, well, there are a lot of downfalls, but one of the downfalls that I have, I don't know if you can see it, um, but this is, this is water. And this car actually came, or actually has a sunroof. I got it open now to kind of let things dry out. Um, but what happens is every time it rains, we had, I live in Tennessee, so we had a lot of bad weather this last couple of weeks, but every time it rains, my sunroof leaks. Even when it's closed, it doesn't matter. It, it, it leaks. It actually comes down all through here. Um, and it gets the floorboard wet and stuff. So I'm actually living in a, in a wet car. Um, I do as much as I can to try to try to keep everything dry, but sometimes I can't. So I just want to show you that, yes, I am homeless. I am living in my car. I'm jobless. I have yet to get any money from um, unemployment. I've applied Tennessee unemployment. It's been about three weeks. I haven't heard anything. Um, and as far as my stimulus check goes, I, I don't know. I don't know where that is. I don't know when I'm gonna get it. Of course, I don't have an address where they can mail anything. Um, so, and of course the bank account that I had um, my IRS check going into uh, for my 2018 tax return got got closed. So I'll just give you a little little overview. I do use a lot of wipes, um, you know, cause I don't have running water. There's no running water in here. So I have to use wipes, wipe myself off. Um, this is gonna be gross.
it's going to be nasty, but this is life. That's where I, that's where I urinate. When I got to take a pee in the middle of the night, that's where it is. It goes in here. And of course I find the bathroom and I'll take it in, I'll wash it out and I'll empty it there. Um, I do have a bucket, which I'm not going to show if I have to, you know, emergency go number two, basically. So yeah, guys, I just want to show you my, my setup, how I've got everything set up. So I appreciate everybody watching. Take care. Bye-bye.